Hey guys, Bodhi here from Pierce Maker Studios bringing you another video. Today, we are at Dollywood for the first time in forever. Three years. Yeah, that's forever. Yeah. That's way too long to not be here. We're, we of course joined by Kenny. Um, he wasn't in the last vlog because he wasn't feeling well, right? How would you feel about that? Bad. Yeah. In more ways than one. Yeah. Um, I'm hoping you get to ride the flying ox this trip. I hope so too. I'll make it a point somehow before we leave to do it. Like we me need to dip right. down to the bridge. Like either tonight or Friday probably. Yeah. Um, depends how we feel tonight honestly. Yeah, tonight this is probably pretty close to all we'll do. Maybe might, like might try to fit something else in. Maybe like a mountain coaster, but Maybe. definitely not anything big. No. <laughs> no, this, no. This is the main thing We're, in the vlog. Our big is here. Yeah, our main thing is Wild Eagle over there. Obviously the best right here. Um uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I I mean actually, like currently Lightning Rod is not my number one in the park, currently. It is mine. Yeah, because my only la my only lasting memory of it is when I hit my head really hard. But hopefully today that will change because we're gonna head there first. Or that one. I think yeah. there's a break ride over here too. Yeah. All right, guys. I'll probably see you in the park, or if I see something interesting, then I'll film it. Let's do it. Putting the Jollywood sign up there. All right, guys, we have made it in the park and we are going to Lightning Rod first. Correct? That is correct. All right. Uh, I don't know where my mom is, so I'm just going to pray to God my portable charger and stuff doesn't fall out. Unless you want to take it and your stuff. I'm full. Oh. Well, I guess we we'll, just... We'll probably find I, your mom. I doubt it's going to happen, though, because it's per, they're both pretty deep in there, and the lap bar is going to prevent it, most likely. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to get some off-ride, most likely. But if not, I'll see you guys on the ride. Lightning rod, guys. This is most likely the line. Right? They probably haven't opened the door yet. Yeah. Here we go, guys. Tagris is much better, but this is still good.
<laughs> Guys, we just got off lightning rod in the seventh row. Oh. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Wow. Oh, oh my god. That's amazing, dude. Guys, it is kind of like raining. So, kinda. yeah. It is raining. Um, we're going to standing in an appropriate walking through an appropriate place right now. <laughs> we're going over to Dragonfly. There's no like thunder, so they're still running the rides. So, we're going to go over to Dragonfly and I'll see you near there. That was an amazing ride, guys. I um it definitely moved up. I will say that. It definitely moved up. Where was it? I can't uh, remember where it was. It was like <laughs> it was like 40th I've ridden. Okay. Now it's I can't say it. Um I'm gonna release a new top 25 soon and you guys will see where it places. But that was amazing guys. Alright, I'll see you near Dragonfire probably. Guys, we just got off of Dragonfly or the parks. Vacoma, um, new, the new, um, family sus suspended. Coaster. Yeah, uh, it's a really fun ride, actually. Yeah, it definitely had some forces, especially towards the beginning. Like, down the first drop was pretty intense, and like, the first turn was pretty good, too. Definitely got wet, though. Yeah, um, all right, where are we going? Wild Eagle. Sure. I guess, guys, I'll see you at Wild Eagle. <laughs>
guys, I just got off a wild eagle. That was painful because of the, um... Pretty painful. <laughs> because of the friggin' rain. Ra yeah, rain. Um, I will admit, it's not the smoothest coaster I've ridden anymore. It doesn't really have a rattle, it's more of a vibration now. You know? Like, you see, oh, it's a little vibration. You know? Like, every now and then you just get a little vibration. Um, but it's definitely not like a rattle like people say. You know? Um, Kenny, what'd you think? It was good. Yeah, good run. always, except for the <coughs> few thousand bullets that hit me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So, I think we're going to Mystery Mine now. Right? Yeah. Um, so, I'll see you guys. Please, this affords me a clever segue into my next story. This here tale's about Timber Canyon's own Wrong Way Joe. Back in the logging days, it was Joe's job to determine the natural lean of a tree so they'd know exactly where it'd fall. Well, Joe had a knack for doing things uh, the wrong way. So if Joe called the tree in one direction, y'all could stand in that same spot and live to tell about it. Some say a huge tree nearly fell on the potato shack. But Joe, with the help of his head, broke the fall. And ever since then, Joe's been 20 mules short of a mule team. <laughs> if Joe ever spoke his mind, he'd be speechless. Truth be told, Joe's been doing things the wrong way ever since he was knee-high to a bark beetle. When he was born, he came out backwards. When he got in trouble at school, he'd sit in the corner and face the class. All right, guys, we are going to Thunderhead instead because Mystery Mine supposedly broke down because we saw somebody on the mid-course break run. And, yeah, a train hadn't gone in a while. So, instead, we're going to go over to Thunderhead. We're probably going to wait about an hour for it. But that's fine. Thunderhead's a good ride. So, yeah, I'll see you guys over there.
Oh. All right, guys, we just got off of Thunderhead. That was a really good ride. Really good. Really, really good. Um, the guy that was um, one of the operators, he's like, I like your shirt, like, right after. So His I'm like... His name was Caleb. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, oh, I crap. Mean, literally, I like, <laughs> I saw him eyeing it the whole time. So either he just really likes Angry Birds or he saw it. I'm, I'm pretty sure he saw it. He was either way... Yeah. Or both. Yeah. Huh. Wanna do whistle pump? Um. Since it's open. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Might as well. New credit for so, both of us. So we've kind of found out what we're gonna do for the rest of the day. We're gonna do whistle pump chaser real quick. I think we're gonna do mystery mine, and then we're just gonna lap lightning rod the rest. Right? Yep. That sounds about right. Um. No Tennessee tornado, unfortunately, because um I do remember that coaster. And also, I just don't really, um... <laughs> yeah, let's do it. <laughs> you it's sure? A, it's a new credit. A kitty cut. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Alright guys, we just got off of the Whistle Pump Chaser. We were in the back row, so we got a very sudden jolt at the top of the left hill, which I did not expect. Um, it's, it's like, it's not fun at all. It's just kind of... going here. Okay. Um, yeah, it's not really a fun coaster. It's just kind of there, you know? Got the credit, one and done. Now we're gonna go over to Mystery Mine.
do that. We just got off of Mystery Mine. Very like janky for sure. A lot more janky than I remembered. And but it was a very fun ride. Alright. Yeah, really fun ride. Um yeah, but it's definitely very janky. Yeah, guys, we're not doing Tennessee Tornado, it's 50 minutes. We're speed walking over to Lightning Rod because apparently it's 45 minutes. So, yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. And hopefully we can do it again, and again. And again, and again. Hopefully we get front row and back row. All right, guys, I'll probably see you guys over there.
Alright guys, just got off of Lightning Rod. Phenomenal ride. And yeah. Just really good. It definitely has a bite to it, but it, I, I think it's one of those bites that almost adds to the ride. Oh god, yeah. Because it's like it's a wooden coaster, so it's meant to have one. And it's just it's awesome. The launch is great. I think we're gonna ride it one more time and then call it a day. Yo guys, I got a front row POV. That was great. Um, that was beyond great. The, f the front row is where it is at, for sure. Best, best experience you can get. We should get back in line now. <laughs> um, yeah. Best experience on this, co on this coaster you can get is in the front, for sure. So yeah, I'm gonna get some off ride real quick of this thing. All right, guys, that is going to do it for this vlog. Me and Kenny, we had a great day here. Yeah, we did. Rode some okay new coasters. Um, like Dragonflyer was pretty good and the Kitty Coaster was not good at all. But I got back on Lightning Rod and I can safely say my opinion has changed drastically. It is launched up in my rankings. Um, I'm definitely intended. Yeah. I'm going to release a new top 25 soon. And I'll just give you a little hint. It is going to be in that top 25 for sure. Mm -hmm. Like, there's no doubt about that. It's going to be in my top 25. Number 25. Huh? I said number 25. What, you think it's going to be number 24, right? Eh? Well, you never know. It could be anywhere from 25 down to 1. Yeah. Or up to 1. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. It would mean a lot to me if you guys would like, subscribe, comment, and share, as it helps the channel greatly against the YouTube algorithm. And guys, as always, until next time, have a Cedar Fair Day.